Hi everyone, just for the record, I don't always wear this top. I just thought I'd do a few videos all in the same day so I can try and throw them at you as quick as possible. And this week I thought it was about time to share with you how to make your own low calorie cooking oil spray because it really is simple. And to be honest, I don't really cook with straight oils anymore. The only time I've ever had them in my cupboard in the last two years is probably to buy an extra virgin olive oil as a face cream and random things like that. So I would definitely say this is my most important thing that I actually cook with. And ever since I started using cooking oil sprays, I haven't looked back. So here's how to make it. So firstly, you'll need a spray bottle and you can probably tell where I got mine from. I'm just reusing an old fry light bottle. And then pop in any oil you wish. Now I prefer to put it halfway, then I top it up with water, but you can actually use whatever ratio you prefer. But I do prefer a 50-50 mix because I found that pure oil just gets stuck when you're trying to spray it. And if you add too little oil in, you can actually get a residue in your pan and it's really annoying. And then pop the top on, give it a really good shake and just spray away and you should be fine. You can actually go on Amazon and buy much powerful spray bottles than this, but you're talking 10 to 15 or 20 quid. So I just prefer this because I've got these anyway. And it's as simple as that. So if you like that quick tip, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and you can find plenty more on my blog, tastefullyvicky.com. Even how to remove burn from a soup maker. As long as I don't really have to use any elbow grease, I'm in. Anyway, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching, bye.